I'm starting a front sheet for access. In order to do this I need a new table so I'm clicking table and I'm clicking new. I'm going to design it. Go into design view okay and there I am inside the design of the new table. What I want is front sheet I'll call it text and that's enough ok I'm going to save that table for front sheet ok it'll say do you want a primary key no this is I need a table in order to design something a form a front sheet form so this is not necessary okay let's say no to this close this so there's my table for front sheet now I'm going to form I'm going to say new I'm going to look down here and find table for front sheet and I'm going to OK that and now I'm in design view. OK. Step 1 let me just see if I can get some more room by bringing this down to here. Step 1 I'm going to increase the size of this and increase the size of that now what I'm going to do is just to draw some sort of design on there. I want to colour this in. Alright, so I'll click there, find where my colour is, which is there. I'll take some colour for the background. Let's take that one there. That's pretty ghastly, but still. I'll take that and put a second colour on there. Let's go for something like that. OK. Now I want to put some text on there. What I want to write here is front sheet for student database. OK. Now when I click onto there let's click off again. When I click onto there then I'm able to change the font on here. If I try in the usual way to change the font it doesn't seem to like it. Whereas if I try um, just clicking on the edges that I've done there then it, w it will allow me to do it. So I'll go for Century Gothic here. Um, yes I was just going to do the same thing I said it wouldn't do click onto there and change the size. So if I go to there and say that, let's try a fraction bigger. There it is there. And if I click onto it there, I can press bold. No, that's awful. Alright. Now if I take this, just go to there and press white. There is my title for the front sheet of this. Now what I'm hoping to do is to open this whenever my database opens I want this to open first and for then me to be able to click onto buttons to take me into various forms so let's try that if I click onto there draw that up will come eventually this I don't want record navigation, I want form operations and I want open form. OK, so I'll go to next. I've only got student form so I'll choose that one. Right, on to next. I want text and I want to write in there student form. Push that across there. On to next. We're ignoring this command at the moment and then going to finish. OK, there's my first button. Let me do one more button. 
And this one is to, again, form operations. I want to um, close this form onto next. Here I want to write close front sheet onto next and finish. So there's my second button there. And then finally I want another button. And this one I want to put onto the application and that's quit application. So go to there, right on there, close access. Next and finish. OK, so I've got three buttons there. Let's click up there. What I'd like to do now is to save this and call this front sheet form and OK that. Now I'm going to close this. OK. Now I'd like to go to Macro. OK. So here we are on Macros. I want to do a new macro. What I want to do is to first of all go down to Open Form and the form I want it to open up is Front Sheet Form. OK. And the next thing I want to do is to press M which gets me to maximize. OK, do I want that? No, actually I'll, I'll delete Maximize. I'll just open it as it, as it is on the right side. The thing is that, that, that since I'm doing this for YouTube, then I don't want the thing to fill up the whole size of my screen. OK, I'm going to save this, and now instead of Macro 1, I'm going to call this Auto exec. And what that does is automatically and execute this command. So I close that. There's this. Now the next time that I go out of access and start on the title of this, this program, it will open that and I can work from there clicking onto there opening up these things moving through the files just because of this and it will always take me back to there I can close the front sheet like that or should I go back to it if I go onto this it will close access thank you very much oh, I've got to close this in there yes